The Public Relations Officer of the Ministry of Education, Francis Badago, says poor supervision and teacher absenteeism have accounted for the abysmal performance of students at the basic level. He says the ministry has therefore put in place measures to achieve zero tolerance on teachers' absenteeism. Reacting to a recent research which reviewed 51% of pupils cannot read in English language and other local dialects, the public relations officer of the Ministry of Education, Francis Badago, said the situation was worrying. The report also indicated only 2% of the respondents can, however, read to understand and answer questions. I want to be a nurse because nurses help sick people and they help sick people to give birth. The time on task in the various schools are also given attention. Some teachers we do understand may go to school all right, but they may not have the, uh, the needed time to teach the students. And so alongside the zero tolerance for teacher absenteeism, we've also ensured that we've increased the the rate for time on task to ensure that teachers always stay in school and teach our students he called for intense monitoring and evaluation since teacher absenteeism has reduced from 27 percent to nine percent in the ashanti region he also challenged parents and guardians to support their world's education over the years, there has been a yawning gap in the performances of private and public basic education. This is the director of Peculiar International School, Naomi Osei, as many blamed on too much focus on grades of students rather than the knowledge capacity of pupils. She argued Ghana's education curricula has outlived its usefulness and called for a modern approach to teaching. Education is about training three aspects of the human being uh, the head the heart the heart the cognitive the affective and the psychomotor education is about training all these aspects of a child so the first and foremost thing is for us to concentrate more on then raising up a holistic child before we even think about grades i believe the ghana education system should move from too much concentration on grades to concentration on raising up a holistic child so that when our students stand on the international market, they will be able to compete with students from Singapore, from US, from UK.